On behalf of Link Singapore, I'm glad to present this demonstration of Halcon Anomaly Detection on NVIDIA Jetson NX Embedded Platform. As we move into the world of automation, it is becoming increasingly complex. You may have heard of a collection of buzzwords such as Industry 4.0, Cloud Computings, Artificial Intelligence, Machine Learning, and many other technologies. These are indicative of many innovative developments that are presenting the users and developers of vision system with big challenges in selection of the ideal systems for their respective applications. Here is a demo setup to detect the defects on the chip samples. Halcon's deep learning anomaly detection have been used on NVIDIA Jetson Xavier NX embedded platform. The imaging source USB 3 camera have been used, which provides a compact design. Halcon provides interfacing for the camera in both Windows and Linux environments. The advantages of using the powerful embedded device for deep learning application is that it is simple to integrate with machine vision libraries of Halcon and the development of the application can be done in a shorter duration. The application here have been built using Halcon's library in Python environment. Now, I would like to showcase the deep learning training and inferencing on the embedded platform. The training of the deep learning network is done on the embedded board using Halcon's powerful pre-trained network. The anomaly detection in Halcon is an unsupervised training method where it is possible to train the network just with good samples. It can be very helpful in scenario where it is difficult to get images of many defective samples. For this demonstration, 50 good chip samples have been used for training. Once the training is completed, the anomaly thresholds are calculated. The anomaly histogram shows the classification of OK and not OK samples. The precision and recall scores shows the accuracy of the training of the deep learning network. Once the training is completed, the model is saved and is later used for inferencing. Now, I would like to showcase the inferencing part to classify if the chip samples are good or defective. The heat map here shows the region where the possible anomalous features are present. The decision of whether the sample is good or defective is made based on the anomaly score, and it is compared against the classification and segmentation scores, which were obtained as a result of the training of deep learning network. In conclusion, Halkin's anomaly detection is simple to set up on embedded platform and the inference time is faster, making it a more attractive feature for many machine vision applications. We, come, we have come to the end of the demonstration video. Hope you enjoyed the video. For more information, you can contact our sales team. Thank you for watching.